man. Some of you people out there are downright fucking stupid. When somebody says don't protest a certain way, I didn't say don't protest at all. Running up and down the streets, jumping on, on cars and shit, that ain't protesting. That's not protesting anything. That's acting fucking stupid. And people out there that have the audacity to call me dumb and or this or that, because I showed some emotion in that video and told people, please. We all saw what the man did in the video. How in the fuck can you say what the man was thinking? I can't even say what that man was thinking, but to say I'm wrong and feeling the way I do about this situation, that's stupid the way I feel about the situation, but the way you feel about the situation is right. You go run up and down the street and cause more drama than good. That ain't helping this man's family do nothing. And from what I hear on TV, all these fucking videos people are downloading and and putting this video back up is tainting the so-called jury pool. It's going to be hard to determine what really happened if everybody's putting a video out and putting a spin on it. See? Motherfuckers can go to the board of supervisors. They can go to BART stations and make a human chain. You protest like that, running up and down the streets at a peaceful march is cool. Walking back and forth down a street or whatever through town is cool. But when 15 or 20 people pop up out of nowhere, jumping on people's cars and throwing shit, that turns the whole shit into a riot. So don't. I had lots of people talk about hopping in their cars and riding and helping out in the protest. But no, as soon as they see it on the news, I ain't finna go be a part of that shit. Jumping up and down on cars and running up in front of the police and shit. Get that shit sprayed in front of your motherfucking face. I don't want, I don't want them shooting tear gas canisters at me for trying to go do something positive when a handful of motherfuckers want to see if they can get a free DVD player up out the window of a store breaking shops up and shit. Them people that own them shops ain't had nothing to do with this. And you're right. If you're going to go outside and do some dumbass shit, don't even go outside. Don't even go protest. So those people who think I'm being soft on the police, understand this. If you're walking up down the street, minding your own business, and ain't doing nothing, the police officers work for you. If you have bad intentions and you walking up and down the street getting ready to do dirt, of course the police officers work to get you. Who's the fool? Me or you? I know they work for me. I tell them what to do. The police work for you. You tell them what to do. That's how you control the police. But stupid people don't see that. They out to get us. They out to get us. They only want to hurt us. They trying to kill us. You goddamn right the police are killing people. Look at you. Some people don't even know how to carry themselves. You tell me. You ain't never been afraid or scared of a group of people acting stupid. And, I'll repeat this for the last time. And I want to repeat this for the last time. And I'm not going to say nothing else about this Oscar Grant shit. Because they're killing people else. They're other people. People getting shot right now by the police. Oscar Grant's not the only person been shot by a police officer. Now, do you know anything about crazy, stupid people or dumb people? 
First of all, say for instance, I'm a police officer and I don't like niggas. I'm going to straight up say niggas because that's what most people assume they are. I am not a nigga, nigger, or none of that shit. I am a man. If, any, if you want to call me anything disrespectful, call me black. I'm a human being. So, call me man. So, I'm a cop and I don't like niggas. And I want to kill me a nigga. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to find me a nigga. And then I'm going to arrest his ass. And then on the way, taking him, I'm going to shoot his ass. Or whatever the fuck I'm going to do. You have to be an idiot, zip damn fool, to think that this man is just going to pull somebody out of the crowd and shoot him dead. First of all, if I'm going to kill somebody, it ain't going to be in front of 200 people on a train coming back from a party in a packed station. If that's the case, he should have flipped all the way out and lit the whole fucking crowd up. Honestly, he should have shot everybody. He should have unloaded unlifted the whole clip on the crowd. So one of his fellow officers would have had to take him down. If he wanted to flip the fuck out and just start killing blacks. He just killing blacks now. He may have been dirty. He may have been this. He may have been that. He may have been all that you say. But one thing he did do was make a mistake and shot somebody dead who was being handcuffed. And I was saying in the other video... Was he going to try to taser somebody while he being held by two other officers? What pissed me off about the whole video is that not one of these other officers grabbed him and like, Motherfucker, what the fuck's wrong with you? No other cop stood up and did a goddamn thing. So you can say whatever the fuck you want to about my analogy of the Oster Grant murder. But I know if a dirty, crooked person is going to kill somebody, they wouldn't do it in front of 250 witnesses with cell phones. And you've got to be stupid not to believe that all these young people on this train don't have, one of them don't have a cell phone. Every cell phone they make has a camera on it. So, of course, you know, it was a mistake. So, I, that's a fucking no-brainer. That's a mistake to the highest degree. Abuse of power. Shit. I might want to tell a person to shut up too. But I ain't gonna reach my gun. Shut up! Oh shit. It's fucked up this man is dead. Now all these videos people are putting out is so-called going to taint the trial, the case. But your motherfucker's still trying to get thousands of hits on videos on the same subject. The lady just pointed out to me another young person being shot. It was somebody shot down in New York. It was somebody shot a couple years before that. Remember um, that one guy was shot 65 fucking times. And you motherfuckers act like this the first time you'd have never seen a so-called officer shoot somebody? All this shit should have ended when Rodney King got beat down. But see, since Rodney King got beat, how many people have been killed or whatever in the line of whatever? So please, don't tell me I'm sensitive towards the cops. Don't call me stupid. If you don't understand the significance of being a human being, get that stick out of your ass and get out of that fucking closet or corner where the fuck you hiding at and smell some fucking reality. Shit goes down. People are fucked up and you motherfuckers gonna forget about Oscar Grant and whoever else got killed this year next motherfucking year. Fuck you motherfucking ignorant cockeyed bastards. You've been fucking too. Son of a bitches.